Saturday marked the start of a busy six weeks at St. Paul's Hospital, where the Lights of Hope display is being put up. The light wall will feature stars which recognize those who have donated to the hospital's foundation. The foundation has erected the iconic wall for the last 26 years. The wall is made up of tens of thousands of lights and takes over 100 volunteers to put it up, including engineers, electricians, and a first-year medical student. Heather Kelly is a first-year medical student at UBC and started to join her father as a volunteer at the annual event 12 years ago. She says the exposure to the medical community has helped inspire her career path. Just getting to be at the hospital and seeing kind of what community involvement we could get to help support the hospital, to get funds and donations to help patients and the community. Heather says she has about seven years left of training. There is a shortage right now of physicians, so since I'm capable, I'm just hoping to kind of fill that void in our community and help bring people the care they need. Heather's father, Stephen Kelly, says he's volunteered here for 25 years because he wants to give back. A friend of mine from high school who had substance abuse issues and ended up being homeless, contracted HIV, and St. Paul's was instrumental in making him extraordinarily com comfortable for his final days. He says donations made to the foundation help the most vulnerable people in our society. The people behind the scenes here go above and beyond to make everybody feel included and they have an innate way of looking past the stereotypes and the, the stigma. The chief development officer with the St. Paul's Foundation says thanks to community support, they're able to treat as many patients as they do. We are a provincial referral for cardiac care as the heart center at, at, here at St. Paul's, doing all of the adult transplants in British Columbia. We have huge volumes of kidney transplants that are happening. Since the campaign began 26 years ago, the foundation has raised just over $50 million. The opportunity for people to uh, lend a hand when we know that health care is on its back foot, the community can get behind what is happening here at Lights of Hope and support by donating at lightsofhope.com. The final reveal of the display will take place on November 23rd, topped off with a fireworks show to kick off this season. In Vancouver, Angela Bauer, City News.